Hello everyone, my name is Ilyar2 and welcome back to my Let's Play uh, of EU4 with the OOT Revival mod with Atlantis. Yes, so in the last episode we yet again destroyed the Spanish, at least the Spanish colonial area. And uh, we, well, we beat the crap out of them and Atlanta, uh, Atlanta is now nice and big and oh boy I love that. Look at that. Beautiful Atlanta. So now we own, I believe, yep, every single estuary and uh, coastal center of trade and pretty much every important trade node in the area. So now it should all be going into here, right? Chesapeake Bay is feeding. I, I believe that's feeding in Sumendia. That only, only makes sense. So we're nice and rich here. Uh, Mexico is falling apart, but I don't really care about it because it's just a bunch of uh, peasants. So, I don't care. Not my problem. Alright, let's get all these guys over here. Colima, Aztec, Filmin, Tlapnik. They all joined coalition. Yay, coalitions. Nice and big. Coalitions are plenty. Alright, and I believe England is still part of that coalition as well. So, I'm just gonna, going to not fuck with that. I believe we need to calm down at the conquests. Because, um... Lithuania is now our rival. England has actually left the coalition. Oh. So, Thomond. Still allied with uh, Lithuania, Denmark, Brandenburg, Brunswick. Oh. Wants my subjects' provinces. Really? Do they? Where's Para? Oh, down here. Oh, they want fucking Brazil? Really? That's what you want? It might break our alliance, assholes. Uh, why don't you want it? They're horribly in debt. 1,700 in debt. That's very bad. Uh, Gaeldom. We need to annex Gaeldom. Right. We are going to very, very soon. It'll be very nice. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Yes, yes. Great, great. Uh, where is it? There it is. Let's not tax Mexico, even though they're horribly weak. I just don't want to piss them off. Yeah, good. Geldum loves us. Brazil loves us. Colombia, they're... I mean, they're just too small. And we can finally embrace printing press. Oh. Oh, dear God. Oh, it's been so long. Should we wait? I think we might wait just a little bit more. I mean, dear God. It... 50%. 50%. Should we wait... I think. No, oh, wait. This little piece of land. Hmm. Let's do that. Come on, come on. Janissary. Oh, Janissary decadence and Ottomans. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. I know that. Uh, all right, let's embrace it now. We'll have 100 left, but finally, we'll actually be able to gain some technologies. All right, carbine. Dear God, we've been very far behind for a while. Now we have, like, some of the best infantry in the world. Leather cannon, sweet. So there we have it. Nice and strong. Let's get rid of the diplomats in Gaeldom. I think we're fine, at least for now. Uh, I, sh I should... I should free whales. Liberate whales. Make them into a vassal. And there's also... Oh, no, Northumberland is not a thing. Right, because I probably waited way too long. England, England, England. I could just take over their uh, colonial provinces, like in uh, Brazil. In Peru. Well, probably just Brazil. I only, I only really care about Brazil. Brazil, if you want to, like, declare war on the French for their lands, I'm okay with that. Also, um, Cuba, declare war on Caraibas, please. They're, like, ripe for the taking. Autonomy, oddly enough, is not huge. Mexico, you need more than 2,000 soldiers. You can get more than 2,000 soldiers. You know, we all know you can. Stop acting like you can't, you babies. Anyways, so, um, Mew, looks like Mew, looks, uh, pretty normal. I still, I'm surprised, 10, 13, 4, what do they have? Feudalism and Renaissance. They don't have colonialism or printing press. I'm surprised they got the Renaissance. How did they get the Renaissance? 
They got global trade. How do they have global trade? I don't even have global trade. How is global trade spreading in this land? Whatever. Uh, let's see. Trade protection. Great. How beautiful. Beautiful indeed. Uh, okay, this land's all going to Spanish Canada. We'll eventually uh, take over Spanish Canada. Of course. Of course we will. Of course we will. Um, and no oh, Chakta invading the Portuguese. Looks like it's going pretty well. And yeah. Okay, again, we just need to sit around. Our aggressive expansion's a little bit high right now. Just everyone calm down. Let's all uh, just relax. You know? Everyone's going to relax now. It's relaxation time. We're actually very far ahead of military tech. That's good. That is very good. So we know 18 is where we should be at. So that means we can keep going down quality ideas. Hopefully we can finish quality ideas. And get pike drills. Ooh, 10% 10 10 morale of armies. I like that. I like that a lot. I like it a lot, yeah. And of course, just making... Oh, colony damaged. Of course it was damaged. And go down here. Kill them. Uh, don't use caution. We, I mean, we already have a ton of... Uh, 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 a ton of inflation anyway, so it's not like it matters. Alright. Atlanta, you keep doing you. Keep doing you, Atlanta. Alright. And uh, annexation. When is this finish? 1631. Uh, Chesapeake... Of course, he rose up in Chesapeake. Truce with Portugal has ended. Oh, dear God. Brazil now has rebels. I don't care. It's just Brazil. Missionary strength increase. Yeah, I'd rather get missionary strength increase. Make uh, these Christians convert even quicker. It's always nice. Always nice. Uh, and increase morale for Navy. So Navy drill and pike drills. So uh, we're pretty much going to become invincible. And 5% more uh, discipline. Oh my god, we're going to have 115% a, a discipline. Ooh. And of course, maritime ideas. We'll get that eventually. But uh, we'll also want expansion ideas soon. But we want to get Diplo and Admin Tech, at least for now, so we can catch up. A catch up. Scottish Separatists. Oh no, 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 no. That will not do. That will not do. Oh my god. That is a lot of people rising up there. I need to send an army down there to kill them all, don't I? Yeah, I do. So increase autonomy there to get rid of all the Scots. Okay, let's send uh, 10,000 men down to here. Damn, that's going to be 300 people dead. That's almost everyone there. Oh, God. That really fucking sucks. Might as well kill, the kill these guys as well because they rose up a lot. Where are they? Over here. Come on, get down there. You'll be okay. Land and kill everyone there. Revenge, children. Revenge. The master recruiter has died. How sad. I killed everyone there. So with this, we'll have a La Plata uh, colony. Which means we can also conquer land from uh, English La Plata. Which would be good. Argentine, as it's called. Oh, and, of course, Portugal colonizes San Antonio. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, great. I just want the Atlanti uh, Atlantic provinces, so I, I don't really care about, like, anything else. Hello, Cho. How are you? Uh, I can't lose morale of armies. Cannot lose morale of armies at any time. We got some more treasure. Yay, treasure fleets from Mexico. Hooray! Anomism. Let's see. Uh, current religions. How big is Anamism? Anamism is almost half the size of Sunni. <laughs> We're as big as... Bigger than Hinduism or Orthodoxy. So that's saying something, really. It really is saying something. Denmark is terrifying. They are terrifying. Poor little uh, Protestantism. Never really took off. Never really took off. Uh, we can get universities now. Fantastic. Which means we can build universities. Which is even more fantastic. Conversion successful. There you go. And Namism now is all over southern Scotland. Hooray. Go crystals. That's basically what this is. 
It's just crystal worship. Uh, noble rebels. I don't need these right now. Let's go help them, I guess. Yay, they're dead. Um, who's next? Well, Cuba is stuck over here. Hey, Mexico, you actually have a little bit of an army. Good for you. You also have 262 development. That is a huge amount. We are not number one anymore. Oh, that's sad. Ottomans are just fucking huge. I mean, that's usual. No, we are not going to be in their debt. We'll not be considered in anyone's debt. The Ming are still at 200. How sad. Uh, how close are we to getting um, global trade? It is coming to us in all areas. Just very, very slowly. What over here? Thule, you guys. Ugh. It'll come to us. Eventually. Eventually. Alright, this land's about to finish. So where are we colonizing next? I guess we could continue colonization in, uh, well, the America. Uh, East America, obviously, so we can connect lands. And, uh, Canada. Yeah, Spain is continually colonizing. God, those assholes. I should colonize Lenape because that is the Delaware estuary. Even though it's not technically touching the ocean, it's still an estuary. Which doesn't really make much sense to me. Nah, at all. Alright, and kill all of them. Great. Naval force, yes. Diplo cost, or Diplo tech cost decrease. I like that. I like that a lot. And we're about to fully annex Gildum. Come on, Gildum. Join us. Join the grandest empire in the world. There you go. So now, Atlantean Britain is even larger than before. Sweet. Come on, merchantmen. There you go. Is Scotland still on the core here? No. It's just Gaelic. All the Highlanders. Cute. And uh, so what are all these little guys? You guys were explorers, if I remember correctly. You guys. Ooh, two more galleons. Hell yes. An early frigate. Two more galleons. Uh, thank you, little buddy. I greatly appreciate your contribution to our cause. Oh my god, I'm making 22 per turn? By the way, uh, harbor fees. Let's get rid of that. Fleet basing rights. Bad idea. 22 per turn. That is awesome. Here, and uh, so you killed everyone there. Go down there. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm. Is that all from trade? It must all be from trade. By the way, okay, I have one in Caribbean. I still don't have the Mexico one because I can't see Mexico. But uh, it's Caribbean and the Chesapeake Bay. And of course, we own the Caribbean and the Chesapeake Bay. Which is exactly what I, what I wanted. And of course, Atlantis owns all of Atlantis. Who would have guessed? Uh, we can get... Well, let's obviously get a whole other army. Just to flaunt our stuff. We'll have over 100 brigades. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. A colonial assembly in Atlanta. Atlanta, why do you do this to us? You're our favorites. Simply because we fed you the most. Also, you're you're the only one, one with like a cool name. I mean, sure, there's Cuba, but it's just... That's just kind of Cuba, you know? Alright, so now naval attrition decreases. Yay for copper bottoms. And massed battery. Let us mass our artillery in a single grand battery. Its destructive power will blast a hole in the enemy lines. Awesome. Alright, say so we gain the cast Belli on Atlantean Mexico? That doesn't make sense. Uh, we could get expansion ideas. No, we want national sovereignty beforehand. We want to try and get as much technology as possible. Well, actually, the institution... Uh, maybe we should wait for the institution to spread. We should probably wait for that. By the way, when's the next one? 1650. Manufactories. We need something in our capital. One of those manufactories. Maybe we should build one of those. What do you, uh... What do you construct exactly? Here. You build gold! Ah, that is... Bad. What? So, wait, does it have to be our capital? Is Atlantis capital area? Mm -hmm. Is not an island. Is in a state, obviously. Development's at least 20. See, here's the problem. Uh, it's gold, so I can't build a manufacturing. Because gold doesn't have manufacturing. You can't build more gold. 
Ooh, that is a problem. By the way, how much mercantilism do we have? Only 7%. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Hey, that's pretty bad. Spain conquering Morocco. Oh, how beautiful. Shared interest. Oh, hell yes. Gaining one diplo power? Nope. Oh, yes, we did. Ha ha ha. Well, I'm 58, so it's not like it matters. Uh, Zisemia. This does not sound like a male name. I mean, okay. I don't wonder where they got all these names from. It's Atlantean, so, you know. You know how it is with those filthy, filthy Atlanteans. All right, so Sutherland is next to convert to glorious anomism. Glorious, glorious uh, anomism. All right, and finish off the reformed. Is this the last? No, there are reformed people in, like, Germany. But it's, yeah, it's Catholic in the Holy Roman Empire, so they're kind of screwed. And by kind of screwed, I mean, like, really fucking screwed. Uh, so Thomond, we've already proven our worth against Denmark. Did Denmark rebuild their army? I'm sure they did. Our army, navy. Yep, they rebuilt their navy. I mean, they only have 11 heavies now, but that's something. And 43 transports. Jesus Christ. That is a bit much. A bit much indeed. Um, you know, with all this money, we can build a lot more transports. Let's build, um, so we can transport two armies now. We have 40 transports. That'll be good. So two armies transporting. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Uh, is this a galleon? No, one of those is an, oh no, early frigate. Right. Uh, yes. Try even harder to earn your place. Earn your place in my court. Yay, Austria became Holy Roman Emperor again. But it's not like it matters because they're losing a ton of power. Lots of heretic princes. Lots of heretic princes. Lots of claim on a province. Cool. It's too expensive. Cool. What are these? Caraibas uh, peasants. And now you have Fox occupying Louisiana. Beautiful. Uh, when can we? Okay, we can we can get global trade now. We just need enough money. That's uh, of course a problem. Thank you, Empress Consort. It's like a queen consort, but an empress. Okay, I'll let me go over here. No, 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 not the soldiers, you guys. Go over here, and you know what? Uh, why don't we bring you all over there as well? I should take this land from Portugal. I mean, there are the islands. Portugal and Spain, I need to take over these islands from them. And uh, England all the way down there as well. Hmm. I mean, my main goal is to take over all the Atlantean islands. I'm mostly there, right? Right, pretty much. I'm pretty much there. Oops, yep, Spain took over a good portion of uh, northern Morocco. Morocco? Who the fuck is that? Ikaika. Are you an empire yet? Ikaika, you guys are uh, highly powerful. 119,000. You, um, Mews. You're the Mew people. I mean, you don't have that much technology. Only It's 10, 13, 14, so we're... Quite a few techs ahead, yeah. We're 17, 17, 18. But that is nothing to scoff at. You are a dangerous son of a bitch, aren't you? Mm, you are indeed. Oh, and it looks as though Spain has colonized all the way back here. That's technically Canada. It looks gross, but that is technically Canada. Oh. This piece is uh technically California. California is so fucked up because the um the uh, uh, Northwest Passage. So screwed up. So screwed up, indeed. Yeah, but it is kind of weird how technically this is now its own continent to this. Because they're not connected. They're not. No, we want trade efficiency increased. Good, 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 good. Yes, quite, quite, quite. Um, Navy, there you are. Get over here to unite with the rest of the Navy. So what's our next big war? Thomond, I guess. Do you still have claims on them? We do not. We should probably build up claims then. England. We're going to have to invade England eventually. But I'm just kind of scared we're going to we're going to lose our alliance with France very soon. But with England, we probably should conquer the Braz their colonies first, not their uh, mainland. All right, national sovereignty, sweet. So we can get another idea. So we already have 
one of each. So that's uh, that's great. Um, quantity ideas. Why not? There you go. We finished quality ideas and more morale of armies, so our armies are pretty fucking deadly now. Alright, you know what? This is where I'm going to have to end this episode. Oh, yes, so... Atlantis it didn't do much conquering in this episode, but we did uh, well, get a ton of money and get... What was it? The printing press. We're soon to get global trade. It's awesome. So thank you guys so much for watching. I've been Ilya too, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.